Hello, hello. How's it going out there, folks? Welcome back here to a uh, Tuesday night here. November 5th, election night. About 11.24 p.m. here, California time. Latest activity shows uh, some earthquake activity here across the Perucelli Trench. Not a whole lot going on here through the Western Pacific. It's actually awfully quiet there. If you look on the last 24 hours of earthquake activity, this region has gone absolutely quiet. And that's almost unheard of out here in the plate tectonic world. Look at that. Not a whole lot shown up there through the plate tectonics there across the Western Pacific. More so across the uh, Perucelli Trench and uh, potentially out here across the west coast of California and down into the Baja California area 4.0 also some activity off the coast there of Canada showing up so let's take a look here see what we got here for California activity uh, specifically out here the latest quake a 3.1 uh, off of the San Andreas well not the San Andreas fault but the, the uh, Cascadia mega thrust area Mostly smaller microquake activity out here across the southern portion of the state. But the USGS is not really showing uh, what's going on out here on the big scheme of things here. If you look on the US, the uh, EMSC model, we got a trail of activity here from the Middle America Trench through Baja, California. Um, that three-pointer there across the Eureka area and then stretching up into the uh, the uh, northern edge of the Cascadia subduction zone with a 4.3. So things are actually still on the elevated uptick out here across this area of the plate boundary. Although the USGS not stating that, uh, we are seeing some elevated activity out here. Uh, trimmer activity out here tonight. Let's go ahead and take a look here at the trimmer map. 117 epicenters of trimmer southern coast here of oregon so nothing uh nothing major going on there for trimmer activity the rest of the country out there uh fairly quiet in terms of earthquake activity uh, a lot of folks out there voting tonight and uh i'm not going to get into that in terms of the election but uh you know the main thing is getting out there and voting that's the big thing uh trail of activity across the area of pahala southeastward towards the louis seamount Nothing major going on there for now across the area of Hawaii. 4.8 earthquake early this morning. Aside from that, typical movement out there across the area. And as you can see out there across the rest of the map, um, it's eerily quiet across the rest of the globe. So we'll continue to watch this overnight and see what happens. Elevated activity here across the western coast and also down here across the South America area. Space weather activity here. Got a little bit of sea flare activity ramping up from a uh, earth-facing sunspot area right here. Notice that sea flare movement. That is coming off of sunspot number, uh, let's bring this up here, 3883 here. A regional sunspot that uh, is popping out there with some sunspot activity or at least increasing um, complex complexity out here in the magnetic complexity area of this sunspot region. So we'll continue to watch that. It's definitely capable of producing some X flare activity, which it has not produced yet. Also a region out here on the Eastern quadrant of the sun that we're watching as well. An elevated 35% chance for X flare. M flare at 80, C flare around 99% chance or so. And I'm still trying to get this cold out of my system, folks. I'm getting there. The cough is gone. It's just my voice is the last thing here. So I think I'm on the last stages here of it. Severe weather will ramp up here across the area of Oklahoma, Texas, Kansas area, bringing with it the, that uh, tornado threat once again as we head towards the weekend. This is going to be a big deal because it will be tapping into some moisture out here from this potential hurricane there in the Gulf of Mexico. As we put that further into motion there, uh, it pretty much dissipates and uh, lingers off towards the eastern portion of the country. California getting in on some storm systems out there, and that's okay by me. Uh, we need some rain out here, and it looks like the storm door may be open here for the California area as we head deeper into the November time period. So that's okay with me, folks. Uh, seismograph stations out here looking uh, pretty quiet. Not a whole lot going on there. A little bit of earthquake activity across the Parkfield area. Very small earthquakes. But aside from that, folks, no major earthquake activity 
I'm going to keep it short here on this Tuesday night. Please stay safe. I hope everyone got out there and voted. The thing is, no matter who won, we have to make sure we uh, enjoy this planet and treat it as such. I has one, you know, one voice here. It's a human. It's a humanity issue out here. We got to make sure that we treat this planet well. Uh, we'll catch you guys out here tomorrow morning for the Wednesday morning update. Stay safe out there, folks. Have a good night.